Well, amazingly enough, we actually have some real honest to God live hockey content in this video. Uh, as promised, the next big video that wasn't a podcast so that would come up on this channel was in fact, and will be as you are on it now, my first hockey game since I was like 13. And um, spoiler alert, it didn't go very well for me. While the team did wind up winning the game, I had a very poor performance. And uh, we'll be able to unpack a lot of why I had a poor performance uh, when we're looking over some of the film here in a second. Uh, at first, I'm definitely gonna put a nice uncut, unpolished version of the film. I just kind of stitched it all together just to see what it looks like. And then either in this video, if I get around to it, and it's just because I'm having some issues learning a new editing software, or maybe for sure in the next one on this uh, playlist, we'll do a real in-depth breakdown as to one, what I did right, and more importantly, two, what I did wrong, because I did a lot of things wrong uh, over the course of this game. Was it fun to get back out on the ice? Absolutely. It was a absolutely spectacular time. Uh, my equipment treated me really well. Everything was great. Didn't have any issues making the simple saves, but there were a lot of little things that I did wrong that really kind of frustrated me. And I haven't been able to actually realize them until I looked back at the film when I was stitching this whole video together. So uh, with that, let's take a quick little look sees at what I did right and moreover what I did very, very wrong.
having seen all of that footage, the good and the bad, I think it's time to take away the real important question of how to get better from there. I mean, obviously, I'm not the greatest goalie in the world, and I've never claimed to be the greatest goalie in the world, but there's always room for me to get better, and much like when I was in golf, the best way to learn is to watching film. And what I figured out from watching film is threefold. First thing I need to do is get better at telescoping to the shot. The amount of times, especially on those breakaways, where I found myself going forwards to meet the shooter instead of backwards to follow the shooter in, I got to work on that because that makes the angles a little bit nicer. Another thing I got to work on is conditioning because holy moly, I was out of shape and I was winded on half of them. And honestly, this kind of feeds into this big third thing the conditioning does, that I need to be more active with my movements. I felt like I was a little flat sometimes, and I really felt like I was having a hard time moving across the crease to get to some of the cross creases that I didn't make really good saves on, as well as towards the end of the game when the camera cut out, I started giving up a lot of soft goals uh, that wouldn't have mattered. But I think that's my big three things to work on before I hit the ice next time.